hit me with another one. Another one from the uh, Hunter Hunter versus Naruto? Sure. Okay. All right. Let's do them on drugs. Are they all drunk or is one on weed? No, is I one want. One on Coke or something? Gon and Kiloa both on four hits of acid. Okay. Just absolutely. <laughs> the ones who are the worst at Genjutsu. <laughs> just surfing the very edge of consciousness. Like they, they are so out there, but they're, they're still super powerful. They just have no idea what's going all right. on. All right. Maybe so, shrooms or something? Right. Just like a massive amount of hallucinogens. Mm -hmm. So. What I think here is this puts whoever's against them at a massive advantage because their nen's got to be screwed up because mm -hmm. their concentration's everywhere. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Versus Naruto and Sasuke. Um, mm. Acid. No, let's do let's do cocaine. Why not? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh no! Like... <laughs> no. Naruto's up until 6 a.m. just asking people if they if they want to go to the strip club. <laughs> like, no. Um, Nar Naruto on, wow, I'm talking to a 12 year old child on a massive amount of cocaine. Right. Who is entirely full of ramen and maybe, able to produce uh, maybe the illusion like, of nude women. No. <laughs> What if, what if it's instead it's just like ADD for him because he's already hyperactive and he just begets like really quiet? Like, he, and he starts sitting down in class. <laughs> he's just like suddenly very focused. Right. He's, he's like, like, he's a better student now. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just like, it's just like Ritalin. You're well, right. then they're, then that means the two of them are absolutely screwed because they're <laughs> off their game. I mean, they're essentially poisoned. Right. They're both sweating. Like, Gon is, like, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that if anything, they, process it and metabolize it faster. Maybe, Maybe. they they have the presence of mind to like force them like force their systems to metabolize it more quickly because I feel like that's something that you could do on Nen. No evidence for that. Gon Gon should be on uh, mushrooms for sure cuz he's that wild nature boy. So you know that like he could tell the difference between like okay ones and some really gnarly ones. So anything <laughs> that he's he would doing be doing this on, intentionally. <laughs> like anything that he would be on that's like from the earth or whatever would probably be some like crazy oh, potent I, I i feel like with with the loose I, I don't know i feel like if they're just tripping balls <laughs> i feel like they're at a distinct disadvantage okay that's my belief all right especially if naruto is coked up <laughs> coked up sasuke is gonna just make the cheatery all wonky but i guess i mean we're still putting them up at like the same point like end of shippuden end of green yeah. island arc fair enough i i think though that the least susceptible one to those things would be kilua i feel like he'd be like all right yeah i'm feeling it but you know my my family of assassins raised me to take on poisons so you know drugs yeah. don't really hit me the same way <laughs> no, I feel like that's probably exactly what would happen with Kilua, and Gon would just be gone. Right. So Kilua's so just Kilo walking around. Like, he's right. still. He's the only one who's alive. Like, he, he's just he's just sitting here simultaneously like murdering a bunch of people, but also emotionally coming to terms with a bunch of things that he doesn't understand about his own personality. He's like, oh, is that the way I am? Right. Um, no. He's deep longing to have a closer personal relationship with his family. <laughs> like, he he oh, can't get Grandpa over the Zeno. fact that he stabbed his brother in the side and he cut his mom in the face. <laughs> I mean, but you know what? Like, the way they behave, they had it coming. You know they did. 